hi everyone welcome in welcome back to my channel my name is emmy if you are new here it's so good to have you here today we are watching the bad batch season one episode eight reunion so now that we are on episode eight we're officially halfway through the first season and i have been absolutely loving the bad batch i've always loved the idea of the bad batch since we were introduced to them in the clone wars i really like the clones in general Plus, the added layer of them being special and different clones I've enjoyed, and all of them are just so lovable. Plus, of course, in The Bad Batch, we have the introduction of Omega, who is a very interesting character who I still feel like there's this veil of mystery behind. Normally, I would be a little bit sad if we were halfway through to the end, but we do have season two coming out after this. I think my timing will be pretty well. As of recording this, it's early December and it's supposed to come out in about a month. So I think we'll be pretty close, if not exactly on time for the release of season two. Last episode was so, so intense and so scary, but overall it was a great episode. We got rid of everyone's chips, which is a huge relief. We don't have to worry about any of the Bad Batch carrying out Order 66 at all, which is incredible. Like what a relief, especially because of Wrecker. I was really scared about Wrecker, let alone all the other ones. But yeah, episode 8, we're just gonna go ahead and get started. If you aren't already subscribed, I would really appreciate that. And of course, a thumbs up is appreciated too. And let's go. Oh wow, where is this? Whoa. Are these our boys? Be apprised of all matters here, Prime Minister. Oh my god, that's Crosshair. I recognize the back of his head anywhere. It's Clone Force 99. Uh-oh. This is what they meant by reunion? I'm scared. If you find them on Bracca, hmm. terminate them. I know that they don't want him alive, but what if somehow that alien dude rebels and tries to help them survive? Me? But I only watched you Ten work. seconds till we're both goners. Oh Ten. my god. I mean, talk about tough way to learn. It's like when people throw you in the pool to learn how to swim. That's what happened to me. We know I can't swim. Better get it right. Three, two, Omega. Too late! Run for it! What? <gasps> Was the explosion not that big? Ah, gotcha! Racker. You think I let you train with a live explosive? Okay, I'm not good, crazy. Racker. <laughs> I mean, you're not that crazy, but you are a little crazy. In the lovable way. How'd the test go? I don't want to talk about it. I'm surprised that her intuition didn't kick in and tell her which wire to cut. I thought that's what was going to happen. They've got eyes on us. Yeah, I see them. Ooh, good, they're aware. Ricka, are you ready? What are they gonna do? Ah! Nice. Oh, no, <gasps> Get him! Get the last guy! I like that ship though, that looks fun. Pursuit. He says he has it under control. That's not comforting. Echo, hit a visual. <laughs> I'm on it. Yeah, Wrecker looks like he has is very much under control, for sure. God, he is really being flung around. Ooh. Oh, that was quite the stun. I was just waiting to make my move. Of course, Wrecker. Just waiting for the perfect opportunity. And we have a chance to make a lot of it right here. <laughs> In this dump? How? Yeah, how are we gonna make money? Uh, what do we do about them? We'll grab it we need and be- <laughs> Yeah, how long do they stay stunned for? Is there like a typical amount of time for everyone? Or is it different per person and circumstance? Check this out. What is that? Are those a bunch of bombs? It's terrifying, actually. <laughs> we love the Omega and Wrecker friendship. Duo. Oh, come here, beautiful. Torpedoes. Wrecker's <laughs> <laughs> so funny. We left with Rex. We wouldn't have to owe Sid at all. Yeah. Why wasn't that even an option or a discussion? Why couldn't we have gone with Rex? I wonder what Rex is even doing. Because I would much rather be with Rex than Sid. What was the war like? It was a primary mission objective, mm. comprised of battles on various fronts. Yeah, like that's the actual definition of a war. <laughs> He's so literal. 
That's the proximity sensor. It signals when there's an approaching vessel. Oh. It's most likely a short circuit. Um, I wouldn't disregard that. Hunter, we've got company. Okay, good. At least I saw that. <laughs> no, it's the Empire. It's the Empire. That's so scary. What they don't know is that it's also Crosshair. To our contingency plan. I will have to call upon further assistance. Hmm. As long as one of these bounty hunters delivers oh. the young clone intact. Okay, so they are after Omega. We knew that. At least we figured that. But they are nervous for what these guys are going to do to Omega. <gasps> Look at Crosshair. My man's a menace. They're still on board. And he knows, because he worked with them. He knows them so well. What if we just stun him with our impeccable aim and teamwork, and then we get the chip out of him? Seems like a good idea to me. <laughs> Talk to me, Tech. I'm trying to tap into the Reg's comm so we can monitor their movements. It is so cool how there's one voice actor for all of them. They really do sound different enough from each other but obviously still same enough that they're clones they didn't even look over their shoulder a little bit yes sir push the targets towards the hangar we'll pin them down Roger that Ooh. to the hangar not anymore we'll cut through the artillery deck yeah let's go somewhere else <laughs> that's so nice the tech is able to hack into their comms like that Okay, I'm not going out that way. Our homie Wrecker is scared of heights. That's a huge theme of the season. Is that Crosshair? Tapping our comms Ooh, to track our movements. <gasps> no, he knew. I knew that he knew him well, but I thought we had him. Scavenging like rats. How pathetic. Okay, Crosshair, you don't have to be mean about it, too. You're being controlled by an inhibitor chip. He's telling the truth. Hmm. I wonder what the other people think of that. Remember what I told you in the brig? Yeah, remember. You can't help it. Please, Crosshair, listen to Omega, our voice of reason. <laughs> what? Aim for the kid? Jesus, Crosshair. Oh my god, that was awful. <laughs> Let's go, Wrecker. <laughs> His scream. That was almost as funny as a scream as R2-D2. Which, by the way, I miss R2. Yeah. Hit. yeah, I mean, I'm not sure that's how that's supposed to be used, but it worked. I wonder why Crosshair said aim for the kit. Just because they know that's who they're protecting? Like the main target, kind of? That would break them apart? Or was he that offended by her? Get to the bridge and wait for my orders. I would not want to be commanded by Crosshair. He seems like he would kill me if I didn't listen right away. He probably would. I didn't think you meant we. How are they all gently sliding down that? It looks like a hole they're jumping through. I don't know how it became a slide. God, those are huge. It's kind of cool, like what this perspective gives you. Oh God. Oh, and it's Crosshair. I told you before, you're surrounded. He has impeccable aim. That's so scary. What is that? I don't know like what that is. Coming online, but that's not possible, right? Um. Which means the engines can be activated. Um. Crosshair wouldn't do that, would he? He wanted to kill a child. He did kill children. Oh my god. That's brutal. Y'all need to get out of there, please. But in a safe way. <laughs> plan 7 has nothing to do with this situation whatsoever. What's plan 7? We may be able to break away from the cylinder while destabilizing the core. Break okay. All the way down. It's that or be incinerated. Yeah, or get shot by crosshair. I guess that's our best option. Oh man, this is terrifying. 
I hope they don't get separated this way. Engage. Engage. Oh my god. Everybody. Where are they? Oh, they did it. It's working. Hold on, Hold on to what? Ooh, crosshair. Whoa, is he burning? He was like in the direct path of that flame. Oh my god, there's so much happening right now. <gasps> Did he get burned a little? Can't tell if that's just how his eye looked before. What's your status? We're by the engine and we've got company. <laughs> oh god, that actually <laughs> just scared me. I wasn't expecting that. Is there a ship called the Marauder? I love that. Commander! Commander, can you hear me? Yeah, is Crosshair okay? They're headed for their ship. Stop them! Oh my god. What happened to them? I don't know. What happened to them? This wasn't the scrapper's handiwork. Oh, was it the Prime Minister? Work. What? Oh, the bounty hunter! <gasps> It's him! God, one of my favorite episodes from the Clone Wars was the box. With him and Obi-Wan, that was such a good episode. What kind of droid does he have? Once you figure out one, the rest are easy. Not us, though. Oh, We're the bad match. Surprise. Exactly. We're not the same. And you smart. She is really smart, actually. You're in trouble now. That droid's funny. It looks like it has a pot belly. So it is the prime minister that hired him. Of course they wouldn't come here themselves to do that. This is giving big this town ain't big enough for the two of us. Uh, no. Wait. No. Guys. Sorry, the lady. What do you mean? Yo, what's happening? Was Hunter stunned? Whoa, is that Crosshair? Yo, what is happening in this episode? Crosshair is giving Anakin vibes, low key. Get me on the shuttle. What? Wake up. <gasps> Thank God. Thank God, Hunter's okay. Oh my god, what's happening? This is Hunter's point of view? This is terrifying. I didn't think it would end like this. Like the job between him and the bounty hunter, I didn't think it would be like that. He took Omega. Who? Oh, crosshair? No, not Crosshair. We have to find her. Of course we do. He's taking her back to Kamino. I hope they figure that out. Oh, that episode. Sheesh. Friends, thank you so much for watching episode 8 of The Bad Batch with me. That was bananas. <laughs> I mean, I knew that whenever we were going to see Crosshair again, that it would be pretty crazy. But I was not expecting that. I mean, so much happened in the last, like, five minutes of that episode. First, it seemed like the engine got Crosshair. It seems like he got burned. At least they wrapped his head as if he did. And he had the mask. Kind of like Anakin, kind of like Anakin. It's giving that vibes, episode three. And of course the bounty hunter got Hunter. And I'm not sure if he was stunned or if he was actually hit. I'm sure I'll see what I'm editing, but either way, it seems like he was injured too. And I'm hoping that he's okay. Obviously, the big main of concern right now is that Omega was kidnapped by the bounty hunter. If she gets all the way back to Kamino, it is going to be so difficult, even more difficult than it was in the beginning, to break her free of that, let alone, I, we're not really sure what exactly Kamino wants with Omega still. I am continuously wowed by this season so far. It just seems to ramp up each and every episode, and it's making me incredibly nervous, but excited for the episodes that are to come. Again, thank you so much for watching with me. If you aren't already subscribed, I'd appreciate that. But until I see you in the next video, I hope you stay hydrated, stretch your legs, please don't get arrested, and I will see you then. Goodbye.